Hi there, Lloyd Masita. Speaking to you from LloydMasita.com, who's Lloyd Masita and Thick Person Branding. Today, the day is March 4th, 2018. Time right now is 3.32 in the afternoon. Okay, got this question from a youngster who sent me this question to Lloyd, LloydMasita.com. So if you have a question, you can send it to me at Lloyd, LloydMasita.com. If I get the time, I'll answer it. Okay, the question is, how is it possible? How is it possible for a guy to move forward? Okay, to work like a dog with only one intention, that is money. Okay, so how is it possible for a guy to move forward when he has one sick parents who he needs to take care of, two family issues, three, a brother whose expense need to be bare, four, revenge broken heart, number five, fear to go for physical needs. Okay, too many things, too many things. So you're a young man with too many problems. Okay, so I'm going to answer this question now. First and foremost, which I want to tell you is, it's very easy for me to give you advice because I'm not in that situation. However, I can give you a perspective how I would have reacted if I was in your situation. So this is just my own personal view. I can be wrong. So the first one is, how is it possible? It is very possible. Uh, only thing is you need to figure out how. Okay, so how is it possible for a guy to work like a dog? So obviously you have already mentally defined yourself as a person who has life very unfair to him, okay? When he has sick parents. Now, if you have sick parents, that's a major burden because here you're talking of one person who has to take care of a mother and father. So that by itself is a recipe that will make it very hard, okay? And then you have a brother also. So you have mother, father, and a brother whom you need to take care of. I do not, you know, personally speaking, I do not know how you're able to even do this because, I mean... I can't even imagine, I can't even imagine a young boy who is supposed to take care of his mother, father and brother. Now, here's the thing, okay? If it is, if it is something that you want to do, go ahead and do it. Nobody's forcing you. If you want to do it. And if you feel you don't want to do it, just don't do it. I'm not, you know, I don't want to be this good guy, good coach and say, take care of your mother, take care of your father, take care of your brother. Here's the thing. You have a choice. You want to do it, do it. You don't want to do it, don't do it. You feel your mother and father are a burden, say goodbye, let them take care of themselves. Because I, I find it so stupid that a mother and father burden their youngster to take care of them. I can't even imagine. For me, if I was a burden on my family, I, like you know, anybody else, I'd just end my life if I cannot take care of myself. I've even told my wife that. So your parents seem to be holding on to you, so you decide. Now, in terms of taking care of your brother, once again, this is your choice. You want to take care of your brother, you take care. You don't want to take care, it's up to you, dump them, okay? Because if tomorrow your brother's doing well and your brother says, fuck off, I'm not going to take care of you, you're, you can't blame anyone, okay? So you have a choice. Number one, you have a choice. You want to take care of your mother and father, up to you. You want to take care of your brother, it's up to you. Don't want to take care, tell them fuck off, do your own thing. Next one is um, revenge of a broken heart. Listen, man, grow the fuck up. Yeah. You get a girl today, she is with you, she dumps you, go for the next girl. I've had more than 450 relationships. Uh, for the girl who dumped me, you know, the girl is fucking another guy. She's enjoying her, she's giving him a blowjob, she's putting his dick in her you know, mouth and in her fucking holes. So what, you want to sit and die, oh man, she's with, fuck it, you know. Get, go get yourself a new girl. I, I don't know, when, when do you guys actually grow up? Don't be so crazy for one vagina, you know, for one female. Move on. And last is the fear to go for physical needs. I don't know what do you mean by physical needs. Are uh, you talking physical needs or sex? If you're scared, I think you have a mental problem. There's no big deal, man. It's just your fucking body, you know. You're just talking of someone massaging your fucking cock, giving you pleasure, enjoying yourself. I, you know, what's a big fucking deal? Why are you scared? You, you have a, some sexual problems or what so personally speaking i see your entire i see all your challenges that you have all up here mother and father you have a choice you want to take care you take care don't want to take care let them bugger off your brother i don't know why you're taking care of your brother i wouldn't take care of your, my brother he has to take care of himself so if you want to take care go ahead and take care family issues if they are proven to be a liability tell them to fuck off in terms of your broken heart here's the thing you'll always get a new pussy man, come on. Uh, and if you're a girl, you'll always get a new guy. So fuck it, just focus on being successful, focus on making some fucking money, then you know, you'll get all this. And last, fear to God for physical needs, uh, stop being a child man, grow up, be a fucking man. You wanna go get laid, go get fucking laid. Don't wanna get laid, don't get fucking laid. 
stop acting, you know, all these. Uh, so I'm scared of my physical needs. Well, you're scared of your fucking penis. I don't know. Anyway, this is what I would have recommended, suggested, and answered or advised anyone if they come to me. So whether you agree, you don't agree, let me know in the comment section below. You feel the answer is good, give me a thumbs up. Feel the answer back, give me a thumbs down. And if you think any different, let me know in the comment section below. Live from LiveMysterio.com. Who's LiveMysterio? Think personal learning. Saying goodbye for now. Take care.